G'day guys, welcome back to the channel. It's all happening. <laughs> I'm in the stand here. I've got a wolf just there. I had this coming in. So I waited for the mule deer. I think the wolf has uh, taken off. I heard it doing that noise. I think it's still over there somewhere. It just sneaked in slow. It did do a call. I gave a couple of calls. I thought it wasn't coming. There it comes. Now I can shotgun this or use the bow and arrow. I'll probably use the bow and arrow. I want to keep it nice and quiet for the moment. There he comes. There he is. Look at him. He's a decent size one. Now let's get ready to shoot this thing. They're running pretty quick. Oh, we going, boy? And there we go. We got them both, man. Got them both, and we had a bear call off in the distance there. I don't have my bear pistol today. I will shotgun them. I've got the slugs in the shotgun. So let's pick up this first. I'm in a competition for mule deer, but with the shotgun. Uh, this isn't very big, so that's why we bow and arrowed it. And we're going to get 70 straight away. Beautiful. Get that. And where's our wolfie? We just here. Here it is. Ah, oh, poor little wolf. We'll pick him up. What are you going to be worth? And gonna get 48 for him. Yeah, beautiful. And that goes into another competition. Look at that. Nice male wolf. Oh, where's he going? <laughs> gonna go in the water. I think we can cross there anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Let's wait till he gets about here. Oh, we'll go pick him up. Beautiful. So I've got the bullpup today, the G10 and the bow and arrow. Some of my favourite weapons in the game. I love the bullpup. It's a nice gun. We can use it on all the animals here. The wolf, the bear, the mule deer. They're pretty cool animals of that elk. It's a very handy weapon down here in the flatlands of the Rockies. I'm going to make my way to my tower over there. We're going to try and hunt some mule deer. This is our second wolf. I have restarted the game just to save camping gear and move to this area. And let's see what we've done here. We hit the spine. Well, that'll do. Killed it. And we're going to get, whoa, 54. That is not a bad wolf. Oh, man, I just noticed at the back we've got a non-typical mule deer. Wow. All right, what are we going to do? Because I've got a mule deer coming in. It's only tiny. So what we're going to do is take the non-typical. Because I've got a small one just here. I don't want it. Where'd our non-typical go? There it is moving through there. And these are very rare. So I don't really want to muck around. We lost the non-typical last time. And uh, yeah, it wasn't good. It wasn't a good feeling. Watch it run off, <laughs> out of the river, and out of my reach. Then I called for it and never came back. We've got one here. See how they're round at the top? Oh, this is awesome. Oh yeah, that's an untypical man. It's only a small one. Like, they can get really big. Non typicals. Where's the other one? I don't want it to spook. Oh, you're getting too close. All right, let's keep an eye on our non typical and we're going to shoot it. There it is, there. All right, it's coming. Oh, damn. Really? I didn't do that. All right, we didn't spook him. There he is, there he is. Let's just keep an eye on him for one minute here, one second, and I'm going to shoot him right through the chest. Oh, he's a beauty. He's hit. He's got to be hit. He's going to run out here, I think. All right, dog's got a bit of tracking to do, but we have hit it. I must have hit... I went to go through the neck and into the chest. We might have hit the shoulder. Oh, let's find the blood. It's coming up through here when we hit it. 
Get out of that. It's like, oh, we've got something stuck here. What's that stuck? Is it a female or a male? That's the little male. Alright, so we got him as well. Alright. Please be blood here. Alright, let's pick up this and get rid of the... Because we've got his track up. Which I don't want. We've got another carcass over here. There's a couple of them around. Alright, so you got stuck, poor little dude. So we got you in the end anyway. And you're only going to give me 31. Now, let's find the other track now. Yeah, I've got blood. We have hit the body. So I've called the dog. Here she comes. So she's going to track this. Come on, girl. Get into action, buddy. And, uh, yeah, we'll go pick this up. All right, she has found it. Did get, you know, sort of far for a 7mm mag <laughs> bullet going into it. We've probably hit it in the shoulder or body. Look at this. Let's have a look at the antlers. See how they're curled around? They're not typical. So, yeah, it's a non-typical mule there. We're going to try and take a photo of this. How much are we going to get for it? Not a lot, because it's not very big. It's only 104 kilos. We're going to get 53. Score a 170. We, oh, I hit it in the neck, man. All right, let me... Uh, oh, no, I didn't take a trophy shot. What I will do, though, I'm going to taxmodize this. And we can have a better look at it later, eh? In the, in the lodge. Unbelievable. And there it is. There is our non-typical. I think this is maybe my fourth or I think it might be fifth non-typical mule deer. Got some white tail and one black tail, but mainly mule deer because I hunt them so much. So every now and again you get lucky. And last time, remember we were out here a couple of videos ago when we were here and uh, yeah, I saw a non-typical walking down the river was in too deep of water so I was waiting for it to get into a part where I could shoot it everything spooked and it just ran and the shot that I took at it I missed what I should have done that day is when it was walking in the really deep water was gut shot it shot it in the intestines it wouldn't have killed it straight away would have run out the river and then the dog would have been able to track it so yeah look at that I was looking around here I haven't had a good look at me uh me lodge I don't think I remember that moose. <laughs> hey, I've got one like it in my day. And up here is a photo of me great long lost aunt from Gookamook. Isn't that awesome? It is unbelievable at the same time. She had the biggest beard in town. She went missing. No one knows where she is. But yep, we've got a photo of her up there. That is awesome. We've got the wolves in here still. These are the only things I got in here. The two wolf. And now we have a non typical. Well worth taxmodizing, because like I said, I think this is my fifth one ever of a mule deer. And man, I know I'm saying they're rare and we saw one only a few videos ago, but they are rare, believe me. And uh, yeah, we're lucky to get this. We hit it in the neck. Did <laughs> had enough to kill it, which is pretty cool. The seven mil done the job, the bull pup. And look at that. I'm going to keep that in here for a long time. Uh, the only animals I'm really going to put in here are weird ones like this. And, or a pie bowl and if I get a competition winner you know that comes first, second or third that is ginormous they'll go in here as well so I hope you guys enjoyed it I will be back later in a week I'm going to cut this one short because I've got a lot of things to do this afternoon and yeah I'll be back <laughs> thanks for dropping by and I'll catch you on the next one